Interstate 81, the highway whose future will affect every person here in central New York and how they get around the region. Could a community grid be that option? And good evening, everyone. Tonight, neighbors in the town of Salina finally got the opportunity to learn about the community grid option from Department of Transportation officials. This evening's meeting coming after people reached out to News Channel 9, wondering if one would be held there. As News Channel 9's Josh Martin tells us tonight, didn't change many minds. The signs say it all for this section of central New York. The town of Salina wants to save 81 and keep the highway the way it is. Town Supervisor Colleen Gunnup says Salina stands to lose hundreds of thousands of dollars in revenue if there were to be a community grid. They need to look at the impacts in the town of Salina. Sit down with the businesses. I want a seat at the table. We need to come up with a solution that works for the city of Syracuse as well as the town of Salina. A consensus solution. The state DOT holding its final neighborhood meeting after News Channel 9 asked why one wasn't originally planned in the town of Salina. But then it would end at Clinton Street. There were plenty of questions. If Hiawatha was a heavier street. Even some community grid supporters try to sway Salina neighbors. Diane Ryan has come to all 11 neighborhood meetings. Syracuse growing economically, so it has a larger economic pie to be divided amongst the people here, and I believe that that will benefit the town of Salina businesses. Going forward, the state DOT will have more studies to do and more public hearings to hold. Yeah, this is our last uh, neighborhood meeting, but I want to uh, assure the public this is not the last time DOT is, is engaging the community. A final decision isn't expected for more than a year from now. As you can imagine, the DOT has taken in thousands of comments and is making changes based on those comments. Insulina specifically has agreed to look into changing or how changes 80, uh, 281 impact business and property values. There are more than 40 restaurants and 15 hotels in Salina that benefit from being so close to the highway. Christy? Josh, thanks for bringing us the latest. And to see all of our coverage on the future of Interstate 81, we have it posted for you at localsyr.com. Just click Local News at the top of the homepage and then Future of 81. New